Hey, Style Lushes, Burgundy Woods here with Style Lush TV, your online fashion network. And we are here on the Style Lush set with Gutter Bunny Designs. You're gonna learn all about her in just a second. First, we would like to send a huge shout out to our sponsors, the City of San Antonio and the Department for Culture and Creative Development, as well as SACAN, all our friends, especially you, Frank. We love you so much. You make us feel so at home every time we come here. This is such a good family. Um, so today, we're gonna be talking about fashion, of course, <laughs> local business, of course, but also bicycle safety and this really cool new way to incorporate fashion and bicycle safety. And you know, bike culture is huge here. I'm here with Jessica, how you doing? Great. Yeah, so I've known Jessica for a while now. Full disclosure, we are kind of close friends. <laughs> And she does this super cool thing that I've been dying to tell everybody about. Um, do you want to just introduce yourself really quick and tell San Antonio a little bit about what you do? Sure. I am Jessica and I am the lead designer for Gutter Bunny Designs. And I came up with this idea about fashionable reflective accessories because um, a couple years ago I went on this epic bike tour and I was trying to find fun um, a fun way to express myself and bike at the same time. And I didn't find anything out there, so I decided that I had to create this. Yeah, yeah, and it, right now it's jewelry and accessories, right? Yes, um, but I'm looking to expand into so many other things. I have so many big dreams and, you know, fashion is great because it, there's so many ways to express yourself and I want to touch on every single way. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, so, so the cool thing about all her accessories is they're reflective. So that's the big thing. Yes. They're reflective. So just like uh, your the reflection uh, accessories on your bicycle, same concept. So mm -hmm. if a car, if you're wearing these earrings, the design is specifically made so that when the car lights shine on them, they're gonna see the reflection of those designs, right? Yes, it makes you highly visible um, at night or dusk and even in the daytime too. Yeah. So. Oh yeah, and you know, and sometimes we go out and take pictures yes. and that iPhone <laughs> flash will yeah. capture the brightness of the reflection and they're very, very cool pics. So the thing about uh, bicycle fashion that I've noticed in the past, and I could be totally wrong, I could be wrong, but I've noticed, you know, your stuff is really hyper cool. It's, it's urban and forward and cool. What were you seeing before? <laughs> but not so, Fashionable, I would say. Yes, uh, the things that I was noticing were a lot of um, safety patrol vests, and That's kind of what I was remembering. <laughs> yeah, which is pretty hip if you're a safety <laughs> patrol, but maybe not so much if you're on your bike. Yeah, not so much. I mean, I like to bike. I like to go out. I like to meet friends out on the town, and so I definitely don't want to show up to a place wearing a safety vest. Yeah. I want to show up wearing something cool that I don't necessarily have to take on and off, um, that I can actually be proud of wearing um, at night, so, or during the day, so. <laughs> yeah, no, for sure, for sure. So, um, what do you, what would you say, I mean, there's a lot of bike culture in San Antonio, just, you know, it's huge. Yeah. And, and it's a very social, as well as a uh, fit and athletic activity that's really taken off here. So, um, we have some top 10 trends for bicycle fashion and lifestyle uh, on this episode today. And Jessica's gonna help us with the top five. Yeah. Um, so, do you wanna just go ahead and tell us these trends? Number five, here's number five. All right, number five, I would definitely say are um, keychains. Okay, so and I have we, my yeah, assistant. We have an assistant here who's gonna help uh, <laughs> give these to her because we're mic'd up and sometimes things can get a little weird audio wise if we move around too much. Um, I would say definitely keychains, um, just because they're so simple and easy, you can use your mountain clip and um, clip them onto your uh, little um, loops for your jeans whenever you're biking and it's super simple and easy and you can always just have it on your keychain. So. All right, cool. Key change, great. guys. And top trend number four. What's top trend number four? Uh, number four, I would say the pins. Um, and these are really fun. I wanted to bring some sort of color. It's summer. Um, just a little pops of color to bring to your um, backpack, to your purse, to um, wherever you want to put Caps, it. So that's jackets. Yeah, these mm -hmm. are cool. Yeah. So yes. This is like really popular in fashion right now. Yes, definitely. Cool, cool. Definitely so, say that's, that's a new trend. I'd have to agree with that. The pins are huge. So Moving right along with the trends, we are on number three. Jessica, tell us what the top 10 trend number three is. 
Okay, number three is definitely rings. Rings. Pop guy, please hand us some rings. Thank you. <laughs> Uh, now I love these rings because they're super um, easy to put on and they're adjustable and it's just a great little color pop as well, especially at night. And I love um, multiple of these. I think they're just so fun. Just layer it up and get out there and ride. Have a great time. Yes, yes. that's kind of cool. Yes. I like that. I love that. <laughs> it, you can really see it. It looks really cool at night because, you know, it's You're like... Right. On your, your handlebar mm -hmm. position, you've got... I'd love to put, like, all four. Oh yeah. And then mm. ride that handlebar position with style. <laughs> yes, definitely. <laughs> yeah, that'd be super cool. All right, what about top 10 trend number two? Okay, number two is definitely going to be bracelets. 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 See, I see a lot of really fun bracelets that I like already. Yes. See some metallics in there? Yes. Bracelets of all kinds. Um, again, so we have our pops of color. We have small ones, um, and this is great. It's adjustable as well, and you can put it on just like a little um, wrist, like a watch band. Um, this one I love. It's just like kind of punk rock. You know, you got your hot pink and your black and white, and um, you can put on your uh, your bracelet and just ride around in style. And then this is something new that I'm coming out with as well. And I really like this because we have our, it's kind of like a leather design where um, I've done some stitching with some reflective thread. And I also really like it because it's gold and silvers and you know, I just oh, love Oh, I just that love lush, metallics. So look, metallics, yes. I see as far as like, you know, general trends, metallics, geometrics, yes. shapes. I mean, these are very, very cool. They're fun, they're cool. Yes. And most importantly, it promotes bicycle safety. Yes, <laughs> yes. Which is always the number one trend of this episode. All right, so we're moving on to the real number one trend. Okay. What is the number one fashion trend with gutter bunny designs? Number one is definitely earrings, and earrings of all kinds. Small, large, um, geometric shapes, colors. Um, yeah, these are very cool. I love these. All different fun. Yes, I just love the triangles. They're just so fun. Um, I made these for Pride Month because June is for um, is Pride Month, and Those I wanted to cool. show that I'm an ally, and so um, I definitely wanted to support the um, Pride community That's as well. Super cool design, and I, I see like these are really cool dramatics. Look at these. Yes. Got the skulls <laughs> going on, and the chains, and the geometrics. Yes. Very, very cool stuff. And I love it. And you know, these are bigger mm -hmm. if you really want to make a huge reflective statement. And then you got some cute smaller stuff too. Like these are really cute. Yeah, those were a lot of fun. Just cute little pops of color. Turquoise and... is really popular in San Antonio, Texas. Uh, so this has got some turquoise in there. Yes. Very cute little mono. I, I love like it. that. <laughs> so yeah. And then when I was creating this, I just really wanted to create something fun and um, easy to wear and something that you wouldn't be embarrassed about, so. Yeah, and you know, when I know like the bike culture is just so huge in mm -hmm. San Antonio. You make a lot of friends. Yes. And the one thing I noticed is everyone's so inviting and it's just fun. Yeah. And this, you know, line really reflects the spirit of the San Antonio bike culture, I think, because it's fun, you know, it's mm -hmm. not stuffy and it's not, you know, it's just really fun. So um, I know people are gonna wanna know where to find you online. Where can they find you online? Yes, uh, right now I am on Instagram and Facebook uh, under Gutter Bunny Designs, and I have a Gmail account as well. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. and then uh, what do you have coming up in the near future? Any Anywhere that people can find you, or maybe even, I know you may want to meet her in person. We're big, <laughs> big fans of meeting our community. Yes, um, well, uh, in July, I'm going to be at Brick a lot, so definitely check me out there. I love Brick. Yeah. Well, we are online media. So. <laughs> this is actually television, but you can find us online at stylishtv.com. You can find a lot more information about Jessica and Gutter Bunny Designs on stylishtv.com. Before we go, we do want to send a huge shout out again to our sponsor, uh, SACAN and the Department for Culture and Creative Development. Thank you for giving our fashion community an even broader voice in the community. And thank you for being here. Yes. I've been dying to kind of share her with everyone for a while because her concept is just super cool. And it promotes not just fashion, but it promotes safety as well as community unity. So I really thank you, Jessica, for being on Stylish TV yeah. this month. All right, guys, until next time, don't complain, come fancy. Bye.